I think uh, to define myself as um, someone who, frankly, a very normal person <laughs> is how I would define myself. It's um, someone who likes to live life to the fullest and loves to seek every opportunity that's out there and uh, make the best out of it, whether it's in my personal life or whether it's in the work life. But um, doing the best I can is the motto that I live by. I'm completing 19 years with Intel. Uh, joined Intel pretty much out of college. It's been an amazing journey. I joined Intel as a junior market exec. Um, and every step of the way I had um, amazing mentors, I had amazing managers, I had amazing co-workers. There was someone around me who was always telling me that you can do a lot more. Try something else, try something new. So it, it's frankly been awesome and that learning process is still continuing. As Intel we are I would say 200 percent committed uh, to working hand in hand with the government and making this dream or vision a reality. We have to do it. Uh, we focus on areas where we have the expertise and we can add the highest value. Um, and these areas are skill development. So we do a lot in the, in the field of digital literacy. Uh, we focus a lot on innovation because innovation is in our DNA. It makes Intel what Intel is. Uh, and we, we are working with the government to take innovation to the grassroots level so that makers in India, whether they are sitting in villages or towns, but if you have an inquisitive mind, if you know how to use technology and you want to use both to create solutions for India, you have a platform to do that. And we think it's going to be critical uh, for the successful adoption of technology in this country. Uh, one of the issues we face, and not just in India, but all over the world, is when women drop off for various reasons, whether it's uh, to, for maternity, you know, because they, they, they are going to bring up a child, or whether it is they want to look after their aging parents, or sometimes even health issues. But when women drop off, it's extremely difficult for them to get back into mainstream, right? And most companies will not have a focused program to get women back into mainstream. Uh, that's what we are trying to bridge with the Home to Office program. It's a program that is looking at uh, creating an opportunity for women to come back to the workforce um, and in technical roles. Uh, we are extremely pleased to work with Shiro's Rose as one of our partners uh, to, to, uh, to drive this Home to Office program. Um, it's just one of those things you have to do. Uh, there have been tons of take charge moments in my career. Um, I think the one that's the most recent is coming back to India three years back um, and being asked to take charge of uh, South Asia, which is India and the neighboring countries. Um, I think it's just it was just fantastic timing because uh, just then the whole digital India and thinking about how technology can be used as a development platform in India uh, started taking shape. So as I keep saying, Digital India is going to be India's watershed moment. When it happens, the world is going to see the biggest transformation that it has ever seen. And it's just fantastic to be here, to be part of that journey, and to be able to contribute to that journey.